this it's isa um i am gonna do a dutch pour today I'm using all different kinds of paints um the base paint that i have on here right now is the artist loft ready mixed pouring paint in the metallic white which is this right here um then i'm going to use a couple of the um folk art flash colors i'll tell you the colors as i do it so i put the base coat down um I'm gonna torch out a couple bubbles, I see. Um, not really gonna do a classic Dutch. I'm gonna kind of, cause I'm not gonna flood um, the colors. I'm saying Dutch because I'm gonna use the hair dryer, so. It's a hair dryer blowout, I guess. If you don't flood them, then it can't be considered a Dutch, right? I don't know. I didn't make the rules. All right. So <clears throat> I'm going to use Prussian Blue by Grumbacher. Uh, I don't want to go across. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. You know, have you ever noticed you get your paints out and then these stupid little gnats start coming? Um, I think I'm going to do one like Tammy did one a while back, like three corners. So I think I'm going to kind of do that. Kind of like framing a, a picture frame. So, I'm going to kind of do that. That was the Prussian Blue by Grumbacher. Um, then I'm going to put Bling It Interference Blue by Color Art. Um, these bottles come from Lole Befe. They're very convenient. Um, this is a mix I did with the primary elements. Uh, it is hydrangea mixed with arctic opal. Uh, it's kind of coming off the edge here. I guess I should have brought it back up that way. I'm just bringing, using the same paints just to bring it up because it's coming off. Um, this is Blue Flash Color Shift by Folk Art. Primary Elements, Payne's Gray. And then I'm going to use some Deco Art 24 Karat Gold. If you hear a dog whining, that is my whiny bulldog. 
She thinks I'm talking to somebody in here. Um, put some more of this bling it blue. Bobo, that's enough. Jeez. And then I'm going to put like a, because this is all shimmer, okay? I'm going to put a regular white. I actually want to put like a greenish. I'm going to do aqua flash in here, like a greenish blue. You guys, I probably got way too much paint. But they're all so pretty. All right, then I'm just gonna put a flat white, which is Amsterdam and Flotra, which is actually also called the cell activator in some circles of acrylic pouring. It used to be called just white paint, but now it's a cell activator. Okay. So I am going to pop these bubbles. And we're going to blow it out. Um, I don't know if my little hand blow dryer is strong enough. Let's see. Yeah, it's been so long since I used these things. It might not be strong enough. No, it's not. All right, here's a volume warning. time my paint is thick all right we're going to the airbrush because I need a little bit more pressure I should have thinned out my paints a little bit more
I want it to go over the edge. In both sections. I think I'm going to leave it. I love the way the two different colors of whites, so you can totally see it. And I have something in my paint right there. I like this. I'm going to put a little bit more here. guys. There's my skewer. Koja has made his appearance. Thanks big guy. Appreciate it. I love the two different colors of white. You can really see it. All right. My torch just to get bubbles because I'm kind of blown with an airbrush or a <clears throat> Whatever blowing apparatus you choose to use, you're adding air into your paint. And I just recently shook all them because I haven't used them in a while. Should have used a little, should have thinned them out a little bit, but I don't know, I really like it. I like it, I like it, I like it. Let me just make sure that these sides. Bobo, I'll be out in a minute. Nobody's in here. She thinks she's missing out on something. Just getting the sides to totally match. But, I mean, I can work on them. Without you, I guess. Let me get you for a close-up. Hang on. Okay. Can you see it? Whoops. This damn light. All right. So using just the flash on the phone you'll be able to see <clears throat> I think the differences in the whites see that right there it's like lacing with the white I think that looks super cool and it goes all the way up through have a very steady hand guys there maybe that's better I'll use both <laughs> so yeah see all the shimmer if I come backwards you can see The shimmer from the primary elements and the <clears throat> right here you can see that the white metallic has mixed in with the um, 
the blue bling it. See how it's shimmering blue. All right, guys. So there it is. I don't know if you can see it better with the lights on or off. Let's see. That's it with the lights on. <sighs> I don't know why my autofocus is on. Ugh. All right, so this is with all of the lights off. So, there you have it. Just a quick little hair dryer blowout. And, uh, when this dries, I'll put some resin on it. And it will go up on my Etsy shop. When I load it up. <laughs> so, please don't forget to subscribe. Um, with this video, I am doing my 3,000 subscriber giveaway so under this particular video if you want to be involved you must subscribe to my channel if you're not already uh, like it and leave a comment because the comments under this video is what the giveaway will be based on so leave a comment under this video to be entered into the subscriber giveaway that I will be doing probably sometime next week. You gotta get a couple things together. But uh yes. So if you are already a subscriber, thank you. If you are not, please consider subscribing. Um and then comment again on this video. There's the side of that one. To be entered in the giveaway. So, um, if you're looking for a fun Facebook page to join, come over to United We Pour with Tammy and Lisa. I run that with Tammy Anderson from Tammy Anderson Art. And uh, we also have monthly challenges over there with um prizes also so um yes lots of things happening guys so um remember this video comment on it and you will be entered into my subscriber giveaway thanks guys have a great day thanks for watching